Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I make a really simple stromboli. I'm going to be using this pizza blend of cheese, fresh mushrooms that I have to wash, spinach, pepperonis, the Pillsbury pizza crust, and cheese of course. So I have my cookie sheet here covered in aluminum foil um, that I did grease but you can't really tell. I'm going to unroll my Pillsbury um, pizza crust and use my fingers to um, just kind of spread it out make sure it goes from end to end like you see me doing here uh, make sure it covers each corner after I get it to the length that I want to get it to I'm going to add two tablespoons of marinara sauce right to the middle and then I'm going to spread that out until it's about an inch within an inch or two or within the edges of the entire um, piece of dough then I'm going to add my toppings now the toppings that I used were fresh mushrooms spinach pepperonis and of course cheese but you can add whatever um, toppings that you would like um, as long as it as you don't overstuff the inside of your dough um, so things don't just peel out of it pour out of it and rip holes in your dough um, now I'm just going to um, add the rest of my ingredients as I said I use mushroom pepperoni um, spinach and of course cheese this piece of cheese that I am using um, it has just mozzarella provolone and um, Parmesan cheese and Asiago cheese but I'm going to roll the entire dough kind of like a cinnamon roll till it reaches the end and take the end of the dough that's left over the side and just roll that over it I'm going to tuck the ends and roll it back over and then it will look just like that and here is what both of mine look like I'm going to do a simple egg wash I'm going to show you how I get that started so inside my little bowl here I'm going to crack one egg I'm going to add um, about half a teaspoon of Italian seasoning a little salt and I'm going to get that mixed in and paint it over my bread I also put just a splash of extra virgin olive oil um, in this in my egg wash um, just for that extra little shine um, you can make an egg wash with a, like two tablespoons of water or um, a tablespoon of milk um, but I just like to add a little oil to mine but I'm going to mix that up really well with my brush here and just get this nice little egg wash basted or painted or um, topped over my stromboli crust and then I'm going to put this in the oven um, that I have set for 375 and I'm going to bake it for roughly 15 minutes Now when you are covering your stromboli, you do not have to use the egg wash. I just like that sheen um, that it gives to the bread after it's finished baking. Um, but when you use an egg wash, make sure you get all of the dough that is exposed. Um, just so it all has that uniform color. And this egg wash will give it a nice beautiful brown color, nice beautiful golden brown color. Um, and also you can see my seasonings and spices that's on top. Um, nicely so it looks like it's all a part of the bread but after 15 minutes in the oven here is what it looks like beautiful golden brown um, now I did let mine cool um, for a moment after taking it out of the oven so the cheese kind of like oozed out of it but it's still all good it was still eaten I'm going to show you the inside of it my kids loved this there was nothing left over it was absolutely delicious but um like i said before i did grease my um aluminum foil but this is the inside of my stromboli oozy gooey cheesy pepperoni you can see all of the toppings rolled in there um, but that's all I have for today. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and hit that bell.